Hey guys, hey YouTube world. Thank you so much for joining me for joining me for another Timu haul. I've got quite a few things here and I've already taken my um, thumbnail. So I'm just gonna jump right into it because I know that's why you're here. Do you just wanna see the goodies? So we're gonna go ahead and get started. First thing here, I accidentally ordered two of these. I saw it in another order that I'm still waiting for among many orders that I'm still waiting for. But uh, yeah. I just wanted to show you guys, this is a canvas, a rolled up canvas. It says, let it be. You guys know I'm into boho, big into boho. And at the top, it says, whisper words of wisdom, let it be. I absolutely love butterflies and I love boho. So this is going to go up. Guys, I got the other picture up. What do we think? This one's gonna go up in short order as well. I'm gonna get my um, my husband to pick up a frame maybe for it later. Oh, um, anyhow, let's get on into it here. Do you guys remember when I said I was looking for the biggest makeup bag the law allows? Well, I think I finally found her. Look at this thing. It is huge. This should have no problem. It's, it's a beautiful shade of pink. It's not the kind that's hard. In fact, it feels, as I'm taking it out of the bag, it feels kind of um, sort of like a rubbery feel. I can't explain it, but it is a fabulous makeup bag. Yep, I have finally found the one. I probably, between the free bags I get every month for the, or I've gotten every month for the past four years with Timu, uh, not Guys, I've got Timu on the brain. With um, Ipsy and um, all the ones I've just bought here and there, TJ Maxx, Timu, wherever, I have got so many, it's just insane. But this is the one. It's got a zipper compartment in the front for um, goodies. It has a really nice solid zipper. And look at all the space inside. Holy guacamole. Yeah, this is gonna hold all my makeup and more. Maybe even some of my meds. I am tickle pink with this. Okay, next. Um, I just had my scissors. Yeah, I started just cutting into a few things before I even got started because it, this just takes so much time cutting things open. Guys, I don't know why, but I had finished an order and I decided I wanted to add an add-on or a couple of add-ons, and this ended up being one of them, and this is just not me. I mean, I'm into makeup, and I'm, loved, I'm into glam, but this is just not me. I think you could just use it as a hanger for any type of bag, or either, or even a, um, a keychain if you'd like to use it in the traditional way, but yeah, this is not me. So this will probably go in a giveaway, if I don't lose it. <laughs> okay, guys, next. We're gonna get on through this stuff. Cause the longer the video, the longer the upload time. Guys, I think everybody has probably already hauled these, but me, but it's my turn. These soft, cushy, furry slippers. And I love the neutral shade. These bad boys will go with anything to run outside and walk the dog or just run out to the car a second or what have you. They are fat, they have a nice rubber bottom so they won't slip in the rain. They're just wonderful. I, and I could not be happier with the colors. Could not be happier with the color. In fact, I might order it in another color, maybe a pink. You know we girls love our pink. All right, let's move on to the next thing. Oh, what is that? Here's another framed item. I don't think this is the same one though. This is a smaller tube or not a framed item. Um, yes, looky. This is a tiny canvas. This is probably an eight by 10 frame would handle this. And that other one is probably a 12 by 14 frame, which can easily be found at Hobby Lobby, Walmart, probably um, Dollar General, anywhere. But um, yeah, I told you I'm going full boho and I absolutely love moon themed goodies. So yeah, this is the one I actually ordered two of, or I may have ordered two of both of them by accident. 
sometimes I'm not thinking I'm, when I'm just putting stuff in my cart. And sometimes I'm not paying attention to the number of items in my cart. And also, guys, once you've made a purchase out of your cart and you do not want that item again, don't forget to remove it. And that will save you a lot of these doubles that I wind up getting. Of course, I need items for um, giveaways. So, you know, it's not that big of a tragedy to have two of things for me. But if you're not doing videos and not planning on giving anything away, it's, it's probably not. You probably need to be really cautious about removing things out of your cart once you've made a purchase. Okay, guys. This is one thing I was kind of excited about. They're smaller than I thought I was going to be. Let's get them cut open. These. Now, let me open them for you so you can see better. These, as you can see, are liquid lipsticks. And they have the little stars, little stars on them. And I think we all know what that means. Jeffree Star. Now, I know a lot of people have different feelings about Jeffree Star. He's been in the industry a long time. He's had his brand for a long time. I don't, I'm so old and, and out of the loop. I don't keep up with a lot of the YouTubers, social media drama that goes on between um, influencers. So, I really don't know what all he's gotten himself into, but I really don't have a problem with him. But as you can see, this is Jeffree Star. This is his actual product and as you can see yeah it's a dupe and as i said these are liquid lipsticks so they are going to um dry down and most of the time they're comfortable enough for me but um if you need them to be a little bit more comfortable on the lips or you start feeling a bit drier they start looking a little bit patchy just throw some clear gloss on or like a pale pink one any gloss really and that will just straighten the situation right out and i have enough liquid lipsticks for about a dozen people so this is another I'm, I'm not opening them because I'm going to put it away for um, another giveaway. Guys, I have giveaways planned. You keep um, liking, subscribing, sharing, and I will keep doing giveaways. I absolutely love to give stuff away. Um, okay, next. Let's see what we're into here. Okay, what have we got? Oh, this is a couple of little funny things I ordered just for kicks and just for sh shikes and giggles. Look, guys, this is a little rubber ring. It's silver. That's the only color it came in that I remember. And it's just a little rubber ring. I ordered it in a size four for my pinky. And I think the way it has a little give to it, it's going to be absolutely perfect. But, yeah, it's got a little stretch. So, I mean, if you don't order it exactly the right size, you'll be able to work with it. Um... But yeah, I, re I recommend recommend sizing down with these for sure because they do have a little give to them. But yeah, <laughs> I think that's the cutest thing. I have never seen a stretchy rubber ring like that before. Um, let's see what else have we got here. And here's another ring. Let's see what this one's about. Oh, this one um, sort of looks like a combination of different shades of jade. It's plastic, but it, it's a, just a pretty little ring that has different orange, green, blues. I don't know if you can appreciate it in my camera, but these are beautiful shades of, of jade, I, I would think is what they are. And this one, I must have ordered a six because it perfectly fits my ring finger. Okay, onward and upward, guys. More goodies. Okay, I'm dropping stuff too, which isn't helping. Okay, just got too much stuff going on this table. I think it's time to clean it off. Okay, wow, this is nice. I received something wrapped in a generous amount of bubble wrap. We won't argue with that, will we? Never. And I'm gonna keep it to pack freebies that I'm giving away. Um, but I happen to really like this branch. I probably just broke it myself, smashing it on the table after they went to the trouble of wrapping it. But I like this brand, Lake Rain. I think it's the best makeup brand that I have found on Timu. Let me cut this open, because this I'm probably gonna keep and try. Because um, it's a dead-on dupe of the Laura Geller Bake, Balance, and Brighten Foundation. It's a liquid foundation. She makes lots of other products too, but um, 
she she her line is aimed toward older women that don't like a lot of heavy makeup y look on their face. Um but yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. And yes, that marbling is indeed a fair foundation. Very pretty. And it even has a mirror. Call me impressed. I cannot wait to play with this. Um, and I wanted to show you here while I'm at it. If I can get into my other phone here, let's see. Yeah, here it is. I don't know if you can see it that well on the phone, but see Laura Geller, and they come in all shades. They come anywhere from fair to deep to very deep. I mean, she has a very good line of colors. And see, she's won all kinds of awards. This is a really nice foundation. That's why I'm happy to try the dupe since I've never ordered the original. I just, I just want to get a taste for how it works. Um, back when I was a teenager, my stepmother used those the bare minerals. And so that was my first experience with powder foundation. And back then, I didn't really feel like it was enough coverage for all my zits and teenage issues. But um, now I think it's something I would really enjoy. So yeah, this I'm going to enjoy playing with. Let's see what else we got, guys. What else did I cut open here? Guys, I've got so much more makeup on the way. So much more makeup. If my packages would just come. Am I the only one who checks um, Timu about 10 times a day for, for pa package updates, even though I'm already signed up for updates? I just want to make sure I don't miss anything. <laughs> I know, I'm silly. Okay, guys, I've already hauled a different shade of this before and showed you a picture of it, but this is the Rare Beauty highlight. It comes in four shades, the actual Rare Beauty line, and that's exactly what this one comes in. And this is the very fairest. It's called Pearl, which I believe is what um, Selena Gomez calls hers as well. But anyway, yeah. Guys, I cannot get packs of this packaging. Look, I mean, it's magnetic. These nails are such a pill to deal with. But yeah, it's magnetic. It closes so securely. You put this bad boy in your purse, it's not gonna cope and open it and cause any kind of mess. This is gonna be fabulous for you. So yeah, I can't wait to play with that. Um, and I think, excuse me, I think I'm dropping things on the floor like the genius that I am. Okay, this is another thing I think I just threw in my cart one time as an add-on because I was getting frustrated that I couldn't find. I, like so many other people, the struggle is real with fake lashes. I have been trying for years to learn how to put them on. I, <laughs> I don't feel like I'm ever going to be an expert. But what happened was I had been checking at Dollar Tree in different places and I never could find one of those applicators that holds them to make them to make them easier to put on your eye. So, but this this is actually a pair of tweezers, but I bought it to be a false lash applicator. So we'll see if they work. They're metal. They're really nice. They feel high quality. They've got a little cover that goes over the point, which you might want to keep up with in case you ever pull them in your purse. You don't want them to put a hole in your bag or or in your makeup bag or anywhere that you put them. So keep up with that little cover. But yeah. Awesome little tool there. Let's see. Okay, guys, back to Boho. And this is not exactly what I thought it was going to be. Let's just carefully cut it open and look at it. This feels much lighter weight and thinner than I thought it was going to be. Let's see here. Luckily, I have a trash can right behind me. I'm not just throwing stuff in the floor. <laughs> but um, I bought this. This is actually the same material as a scarf. Like this is, and it's very, very, very long, very long. I can't even get all of it in the frame. But this is just essentially, and it doesn't have a place to, to use to hang it. So I'm kind of confused, but um, it's pictured hanging on the wall. Like if you have just a little nook where you need something, um, just a little something to fill in to keep from having so much wall space like I do. <laughs> um, yeah, but it is, it's very thin and it, see, you can see right through it. You, you can see through it to my lights behind me in the background, but um, it actually feels like a scarf. I mean, if, if you were wearing something with a lot of orange in it, by George, you could wear this as a scarf. 
you really could. I mean, this has so many uses. This is a really cool little piece. I like it. Or a table runner. In fact, that's, that may be even what I do with it. Use it as a table runner. I'm sitting here at a big farm table um, because I decorated primitive so many years. I had the big farm table and the ladder back chairs, and I still do. But um, I'll probably always keep it because I have a fairly big family. And on the rare occasion they all come over, we have seating for them. But yeah, I think I'm going to do this as a... Yeah, a table runner. I think that's where she's gonna go. Okay, next, guys, we're getting towards the end of this. Can you believe it? And we're only about 16 minutes in, and we are getting to the end of this. I'm amazed. Okay, it looks like another makeup item. Okay, this is what I have spent about two hours struggling over. <laughs> yes, I'm crazy. I spent about two hours scouring Sephora and Ulta's websites to figure out what this is a dupe of. Golly. They are determined I'm not getting this thing. To figure out what this is a dupe of. Now, they've already duped the, um, the Natasha Denona Glam Palette and the Retro Glam, which was that super pink one. Um, I think I have it in my bathroom as well. But this one, is not quite the same shades. And the, see, you see all that primitive stuff? Yellow wear bowls. Oh my gosh, this mirror is dirty. Oh, it has a film over it I need to pull off. That's why the reflection is so bad. But um, anyway, these shades, the closest thing I could find, now I didn't take a photo because I don't think it's a dead on dupe and I don't want to claim something's a dupe unless it is indeed a dupe. But this is the same shades that are in the Sephora brand Artist Couture. They have a palette called Sensational Mauves. I believe it's what it's called, Sensational Mauves. And in person, this is lighter. My lighting is making these shades look very dark, but in person, these are just pinks and burgundies. And I do believe, not promising, but this is a, um, because this is not a du uh, dupe of any of the current Natasha Denona palettes. Um, but yeah, I think this is an artist couture dupe, which is a very nice and expensive Sephora brand. So, and it's a beautiful neutral palette. I mean, this will take you all year round. It, it's a gorgeous fall and winter palette, but the pinks, these light pinks will take you into summer easily. Okay, so let me close this back. Okay, and I think I have one other makeup item and I'm gonna call it a day for this haul. Oh, and then I'm gonna show the giveaway. I've hauled one of these before, but I decided to show it again. And I'll look up a picture real quick and show you guys in, in case you don't remember. But this is another product by Lake Rain. Like I said, I think this is the best makeup brand. I've tried everything and I find that the products that come from this Lake Rain brand are definitely over and above the rest of the brands they carry. Um, I wish I could get this unwrapped, guys. I'm sorry it takes so much time to fight with these. And I thought I was being so smart cutting everything open, but I should have known I'd miss something. Okay, let me just rip this thing open. But these, and I'm gonna look up a picture real quick. It won't take me but a second. But these, these are the, are the squeezy tube lip balms. And this one is a light pink, but when it comes out, it'll essentially be clear. It's, it's not really gonna give you any kind of color on your lips. Just maybe the slightest bit of pink. It's just mostly gonna give you some shine and some hydration, which is what people buy these for. But yeah, let me show you real quick. In case you don't remember from the last time I hauled one. Um, let's see. Oh, sorry, guys. Um, going back and forth between phone types can get confusing. Um, yeah, here we are. Yeah, this is a dupe of the... Um, let's get it up here. Come on. The Summer Fridays. The Summer Fridays Lip Balm, it's at Sephora. It's, it's an exclusive at Sephora. And it comes, well, it comes in all different shades. Let me just try to go through here. See, it comes in all different shades. 
But, um, and now they've come out with a gloss that has like the, the pull apart lid and the doe foot, um, which is, I think last time I checked, they were completely sold out. But yeah, this Summer Fridays is an excellent brand. And um, yeah, I've gone through several of these, yes. I have. I go through lip balm because I've explained to you, I have extremely dry mouth from medication and different things I take and injections and just my health is just a, a whole story. But anyway, um, yeah, I have, yeah, panned a couple of these. There's not that much potage in them. And if you reapply often, you will just blow through these. These are a great little um, lip balm to keep on hand, throw in your purse to have. Um, but yeah, I think that's about all I have left, guys. Let me, I forgot to bring the giveaway in here. I showed it the other night when I filmed the video, but I forgot. I know exactly where it is. Let me one get it. But yes, um, and I'm actually gonna add a little something to it because just a reminder, I'm giving away this um, dead on dupe of the um, I Need a New Palette by Natasha Denona, which is still in the bubble wrap. I haven't touched anything and, that, and it came with these brushes. You will be getting both of these and this set of eye brushes that I ordered. This is a set specifically made for smaller eyes and this brand, Mang, M-A-A-N-G-E, Manga, Mang, Mange, <laughs> that doesn't sound good, Mange, no, <laughs> Mang, um, these are decent brushes, I have a few of these, and I use them on the regular, so, yeah, you are going to be getting a face set of brushes, an eye set of brushes, and this dupe of the I Need a Nude palette, so all I need you to do is make sure you publicly are subscribed, um, to, the, to, to me, to my channel, you need to like this video and you need to comment using the word, mm, let's see, yellow. I want you to comment using the word yellow. I looked at these and thought of it. Yeah, use the word yellow in your comment. Don't just use that word, but use it in a sentence somehow or another. This should be fun <laughs> to read your, your responses. But yeah, and um, I will be posting another video Saturday latest, I'm hoping. Like I said, I stay on top of my orders and I keep constantly checking um, my shipping statuses all day long. So as soon as more goodies arrive and I'm expecting a bunch of makeup, that's why I'm so anticipating them coming. But um, yeah, I should have a new video up Saturday and I will tell who the winner is then or, or show the winner, I'll pick the winner. I'm gonna try to find one of those randomizers that just picks a comment for you and picks a winner. So, you know, nobody will think I'm up to no good just picking a friend or something. So uh, yeah. These goodies will be on the way to somebody um, after Saturday. And I live within walking distance of the, of the um, post office. I live in town and I used to be a power seller on eBay. They know me by name at the post office. So um, yeah, I will get these right out to the winner on Monday following the drawing on Saturday. So yeah, thank you guys so, so, so very much again for joining me. I'm just blown away that anybody at all watches me. But um, yeah. Uh, there will be framed art or art for you in, the, in future giveaways and um, lots of goodies coming in the future. So yeah, just keep on checking by with me and good luck in the giveaway and I'll see you on Saturday. Have a great one. Bye-bye.